Hi, Valda. Good morning. Is this the famous and the cute Robbie Montgomery? I love you, Valda, already. Well, yes, I love it you, is. too, Miss <laughs> Montgomery. I am so excited for you. I'd like to let my listening audience in Dallas know that we have the famous Robbie Montgomery from Sweetie Pies. We're going to talk about all those great things that you're doing on television. I'm yes. so excited for you, Miss Montgomery. I really am. Thank you so much. I mean, this is truly a blessing. I never thought I would be, this would be happening, but it is, and I'm blessed. We never know what God has in store for us. Because That's I'm right. sure, and I have to let my audience also know, in case they don't know, when you were dancing with Ike and Tina Turner, you never thought you would be the center stage. Never. You are. Never. I was always in the background, and I was happy there. So this is a total different thing. Somehow I ended up in front. But God is good. He's got his blessings for you, so you have to be able to receive them. And you have to be able to go to distance. And you have gone the distance from what I understand because I was reading what kind of led you to this. And, and I would like to talk from a higher level okay. because things happen to us and we're going all, whoa, me, Lord. But yes. I read that you had a problem with your lung that took you out of what you were doing and kind of eventually morphed into this. Am I correct? You're correct. So we never know... My mom used to say, you know where you've been, but you don't know where you're going. So that you don't. Is, yeah, that's, I, I had a health problem. I had, I've got sarcoidosis, and uh, in the midst of, midst of having that, I had to stop singing. So it was like, well, what do I do next? My mom was a great cook. She taught me how to cook in high school. I took commercial cooking. We call it culinary now, but back in those days it was commercial. I know how to cook. So I decided, well, I'll just have to do, the Lord gives you talents, and he prepares you to use them. So I was an excellent cook, and this was my time to use my other talent. And that's what I did, and a lot of praying, and the restaurant worked. And now you've got Sweetie Pies on one of the most fabulous networks, own networks, yes. by one yes. of, you know, our dear, dear sweethearts, Oprah Winfrey. Yes. And, and you're documenting your family and your, your, your restaurants that you are, you know, delivering to the public. Yes. It's a blessing, I mean, to be able to have your family involved in your life. Because when you, want, when you become successful, you want your family to have the same blessings. So this is a way that... I'm involving my family. We can all receive these blessings together. Some of them might not because some of them don't want, uh, but this is an opportunity. And I try and help other people too. I mean, I hire ex-offenders. I do all kinds of things to give. At Sweetie Pies, we believe in giving second chances. And so basically, this is what Welcome to Sweetie Pies is about. A family running a restaurant, trying to give second chances, and trying to feed the world. Well, you're giving second chances to other people, but, you know, you may not have looked at this. You know, you're not uh, uh, the average television age, in a sense. So you're really kind of helping us. You, you know, you're breaking ground with Brett, Betty White here. You're saying yes. that, you know, life is not over after 40. That's right. And, I mean, you know, people tell me, so you don't look your age. It's not that I don't look my age. I just got to keep going. And age has nothing to do with it. If you have the opportunity to do something, I mean, you can, you can do it. And this is what I try, inspire people that it's never too late. I mean, I'm 73, I'm still going, and this is not the end of my dream. I'm still dreaming and reaching for higher things. Well, I love it when you can see a person's dreams manifest, and, and, and I think that's what we're, as you stated, we're seeing in Sweetie Pie. But, you know, like you're, I continue to say, you're breaking all kind of records. There was recently a survey that told us, don't retire, keep working. Right. What are you doing? I'm keep working. I mean, after Sweetie Pies, uh, the, we're going to take the restaurant to other cities. I mean, we just got all kinds of things. If I can live long enough, I'm going to do more. You got a new season. Give me a quick synopsis of the new season, Miss Robbie. Well, the new season, we got the new restaurant open. Uh, we've got buses lined up, people lined around the corner. My nephew Charles is still involved and in not working. My grandson <laughs> is doing <laughs> I got one of those. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. See, families relate to us because they got one in their family. My uh, grandson is doing fine. He was our miracle child. He was born one pound, and he's surviving. We're, we're, we're loving him. Uh, like I say, he's our miracle. He's our blessing. 
And so God is just still blessing my family. I mean, we have our ups and downs, but that's our test in life, and we're going to pass it. I was looking on my Facebook and Twitter page because we tweeted about you, and people said, I can't wait for the new season. I can't wait for the show to come back. I love Robbie Montgomery. I mean, I and I have not read a mean-spirited thing about you, and you know, that's unusual. Because people are so nice to me, and what you receive, you give back. I love people. I'm a hugger. I hug everybody I meet because I truly, truly love people. I mean, they don't have to come to Sweetie Pies. They pass a million restaurants. So if they come to Sweetie Pies, I feel that's a blessing, and I appreciate it. Well, Miss Robbie Montgomery, when do you want us to watch the new season? I want you to watch it Saturday. It's coming on from 10, 10 and 9 Central. Welcome to Sweetie Pies. The new episode starts. Please tune we in. Be, we will be there glued to the television set. Miss Robbie Montgomery, welcome to Sweetie Pies, and thank you for being my guest on the Belder Beatty Show. Thank you for having me. Blessings. Blessing to you. Thank you.